for the title. Line? Oh, yeah! USC is your first ever beach volleyball national champions. That national championship grunt was courtesy of Kelly Clays as she <laughs> hammered it down. She joins JJ and I now, Sarah Hughes and Kelly Clays. Listen to this, JJ. I mean, if, if we're doing power rankings for best athletes at USC right now, <laughs> yeah, I think we're sitting right next to them. 48-0 and 0 last year. They've won 73 straight matches. And uh, the last one, at least, in a USC uniform. You guys had a great summer, too. The last one in a USC uniform was that one... Uh, how did that feel to, to slam down the first ever NCAA championship in beach volleyball? Oh, my gosh. It was so unreal. Just being out there with, I mean, our whole team and being beside my I'm my best friend. Um, <laughs> it was just an amazing experience. Uh, I can't describe it. Yeah, bringing that home for USC was amazing. We had the whole team behind us. So Kelly put it over the top with that kill. It was just a great experience. <laughs> uh, now, explain to me. I got to, uh, trust me, I'm, I'm elementary at this beach volleyball. <laughs> you got to come out. We play on Friday mornings. Yeah. Friday mornings. Yeah, yes. <laughs> sorry, 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 we lost <laughs> JJ in the morning. Of a problem. <laughs> um, <laughs> but, um, you know, explain to me a little bit because I know that there's beach volleyball players and there's indoor players. Yeah. What is the difference between the two? Why did you guys choose to be beach volleyball instead of indoors? Yeah, well, indoor is a little bit more specialized. I mean, you have six people on the court. Beach, you only have two. But like I was saying, indoor, you have your hitters. You have your setters, a libero. On the beach, you have to learn how to do it all. You have to pass, set, hit. Uh, you have to know how to do everything. So, and obviously the element of the sand. Okay, <laughs> right. That's it's a big easy. factor. Yeah. <laughs> you know, we talk about it constantly. Teams, you know, they win big games and then they sort of have a hangover effect and they, and they drop a game, kind of happened to soccer a little bit this weekend. And... You guys, when you win 73 straight, how do you avoid the, compla the obvious complacency that you know, sets in at some point in a streak like that? Um, we just try to take it, obviously, one game at a time. Um, we have you know, our warm-up that we do for every match. We just try to keep everything exactly the same. Um, we have just like little things that we do to pump each other up. And I mean, I always know she's going to try her hardest, and I'm always going to try my hardest for her. And... I mean, we go out there and play our best and have fun doing it, and, you know, it, it worked out. Yeah, I mean, when you win, win that many in a row, obviously the camaraderie is there, but has there ever been a time that you guys have felt like in a slump or not playing that well, or has it just always clicked? Um, I think there's, there have been times where we have been put in slumps, but I think that's just about partnership. We look at each other. If one of us isn't having the best game, we, the other one steps up for them. We just, we're always fighting for each other, and I think that's a huge part of our relationship on and off the court. Yeah, yeah why does it work so well? Because you're, you're very different. You're from different places. You have different personalities. Very different. Yes, <laughs> yeah. Why has it worked out so well? I think that we're, we're so different. We, we just work, our opposites like work well yeah. together. Um, Sarah's the more... So <laughs> I'm going to compliment you. Don't freak <laughs> out. No, I know. I mean, You're like, oh, quiet. No. <laughs> I mean, I get fiery at times, but she, like, really brings it out of me. Um, <laughs> and she's the more social one, and I'm the more quiet one. But she's, like, out on the court, she's so fiery, and that just pumps me up. And I just, the way we work with each other, just, it works. Now, of course, you guys have had a lot of success together. What does the future hold for you guys? Well, I mean, we're seniors. It's just really hard to oh. believe. Yeah. It's um, hard to believe. <laughs> it's I, mean, crazy. I remember writing a story about you when you came out of Modern Day because the story was that Sarah was the first ever player to really choose beach volleyball. And that couldn't have been that long ago. Yeah, I know. It's crazy. But it, it was the best decision I've ever made. But after this season, I mean, we're focusing on winning another national championship and bringing it home to USC, but... I was sort of counting that as a given. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> right? uh, you know, but afterwards, we, we want to play on the professional tour, both domestic and internationally, and we want to go to the Olympics. That's our, right. one of yeah. our main goals. So. And you got a nice taste of that this summer. I think you surprised some people. I mean, you played with the world's best. Were you watching the Olympics going, oh, I wish we were out there? I mean, because you, you it must feel like you can compete at the very least at that level. I mean watching that competition i mean everybody's amazing and yeah. it would have been an amazing experience to go um but it was just 
it was so much fun watching our two teams go because we, I mean, we got to play against them over the summer, but we trained with them occasionally as well. So it was, it was fun to be at home and to support them. But I mean, obviously, it would have been amazing to go <laughs> and just to see how we, we could have matched up with everyone. Looked like a pretty good beach party in, in Rio, too. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 that part. It'll be fun in Tokyo. We just got to wait four years to get there. Yo, give, it, Tokyo. give us a little preview to the team this year. I mean, of course, you guys are coming back for your senior year, but, you know, it's a. It's a team concept because in volleyball there's different matches that have to be played outside of you guys, of course, doing as well as you have done. Um, give us a scouting report going forward of what the team looked like this year. Yeah, well, we didn't lose many players last year, but I can say this year we're, we are very good. We're okay. pretty stacked. We are, <laughs> we are stacked. Well, I'm not going to lie to you. We're pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we've just been practicing you know, every day, and it's it's a battle on the court. We, like I said before, we're a team, and we're all there for each other, but we're all fighting for spots, and you can really tell when you go out and watch us practice, and everyone's working really hard, so I think once season comes around, we'll be a force to be reckoned with. Yeah. Well, you guys are future legends, but you have the uh, Legends Beach Volleyball Tournament coming up. That's at Merle Norman Stadium right across the street from where we are right now, November 4th and 5th. You can call 213-309-8319, 213-309-8319, or email kafuller at usc.edu for more information on that. You know, we were talking about Josh's vertical leap. Your oh, box yeah. jump is pretty <laughs> good, Sarah, too. If anyone wants to give Sarah Google, I don't know what your vertical leap is, but, uh, you know, I'd like to see you and Josh. You want to take them on a jumping competition? <laughs> yeah, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Always compete. Well, we thank Sarah Hughes and Kelly Clays, two of our favorite guests, and, you know, as they said, they're seniors. You are going to want to see them this spring and say that you once watched them play in college because you will see them certainly at the professional Olympic level. Forget two points for safety. Try up to 20%. With Allstate Distinguished Driver Discount, safe drivers can instantly save up to 20% on car insurance just for having a clean driving record. That's on top of other discounts. Call one of 410 Los Angeles area Allstate agents today. While the USC defense has been playing great ball lately, the mastermind is next. Clancy Pendergast on Trojans Live.